When you first moved into that one-bedroom flat, were you working? I was, yes. And then unforeseen circumstances, I lost my job. You had an opportunity to check the property. Yes. Now, you knew when you moved into that property that it needed to be suitable for your children to come and stay, because that was, at the start, the agreement you had in respect of custody with your wife, right? Yes. So, in your mind at that stage, when you saw a one-bedroom property, didn't alarm bells start to ring that it may not have been suitable? It did, but at, at that time, that was all I could afford. Now, just tell me about the arrangement, Angela, in respect of the housing benefit and the top-up. The housing benefit was paid to myself directly. But that doesn't pay for everything, correct? In this instance, uh, John would have been short about £4. There's a shortfall? Yes. Now, where have you got a document or anything in writing which says, A, he's responsible for the shortfall, and B, what that shortfall would be? We have a, a book that showed the top up right from the, the beginning. First, yes. Now, where in writing, leaving aside John's admission, is there anything which says, I will receive your money from housing benefit in the event of shortfall, it is your responsibility to pay? Not in writing. Right. Why not? Because we just kept it in the book which John was well aware of. He signed it. That's the point. At, at a certain point. So you say the rental book you've got yeah. is a de facto admission that he understood that he was always responsible for the top-up. Yeah. You signed this rent book. I did, yes. Now, I've had an opportunity to look at this, and it's very neat and very clear. And you've written at the top, it says, top-up. Yeah. Very helpful. It said that from the beginning, didn't it? Yeah. And what I've got is each week, the amount of arrears, correct? Yes. And after John moved in, he was responsible to pay this money. Now, he had a responsibility after he moved in to pay this. At what stage did he make the first payment? Uh, I think it was July. He moved in in the March. And how many payments were made? Uh, they're scattered throughout the book. It's every now and again that he's actually paying some of the, the top up.